that is our kitchen basically. This is our foyer. This is the back room where we used to feed the dog. And this is day zero of our kitchen renovation 213. It's Monday, June 3rd, 7.14 a.m. Temperature is 2 above. This is our living room. We left the furniture here because we're going to be uh, basically camping out here, eating here, watching TV here, until they have time to paint all of this in the vaulted ceiling. And then here is everything we did. We, this used to be our dining room right here. We used to have a, those cabinets over there. This is our closet. We were going to try and cut this out, but I'm thinking uh, maybe we'll just leave this here, this wall, tear out this wall, move it up to the ceiling, our stairs. We're going to throw out this door. Respect my authority. We're going to try and salvage the paint job from uh, here down. We don't really care about here. Of course, this will be gone. Our fridge is full. Took off the magnets, but you know we got food in here and all that. There's nothing in here. 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 Nothing in here, nothing in here, nothing in here, uh, nothing in here either. I'm going to throw out the stove, thank God. I, I had a fire in here yesterday cooking wieners. It's all empty, yep. Sink. We're going to move the sink, of course. In the seat first video. This dishwasher works perfectly good, but we're, we've got a new one coming, and uh, I'm going to give this to my mom's. Hers just broke the other day. Yep. This is all gone. This will be the moose. We're going to try and save, well, we will save all the light switches. This will be gone. Mental notes, we need new, new lighting. Got to move the thermostat, door chime, hopefully there's a wireless one to keep. This is the back room. I'm going to throw out this uh, laminate flooring. It's 111 inches by 211 inches. Unless it's easy to pop out. Uh, my brother said he might need it or want it. We didn't take this downstairs. We didn't take this downstairs. Hopefully they can just move this. We got our cat who was a bit sick last night. Seems to be okay now. Are you okay, Zizi? Say hello to everybody. Hello, Zizi. No, no. Okay, good, good, Zizi. The blankets. We're going to leave the TV there because it's on a Put everything wired up there. All this ceiling. Is going to be scraped off. And along with this, we're going to put a whole new ceiling with a plain drywall I guess. I've got the parts for this. I don't know if I'm going to keep it, but I don't think so. I'm going to throw it out. Got stuff. Bathroom. 
Now I gotta keep this. We're gonna throw out the TV, I mean the toilet. Okay, we have a new toilet coming. I guess this will stay. It's right now it's hooked around all the plumbing, so we left it there. Uh, keeping the sink, maybe a new thing here, maybe not. New floor in here. We're trying, we're gonna save the, uh, the whole paint job in here. Hopefully cover up that hole with something. These doors are going to be new. We're going to get new doors, new door handles. In the basement, took a lot of work. Then we got rid of our hutch and china cabinet. Cleaned up. I got, I got like a 37 boxes of stuff. To Red. Got some furniture here and stuff behind here. Got a cat. I'm gonna eat and have litter. This is our range for upstairs. This is uh we kept all the drawers just so it's easy to put all the cutlery and stuff in there. Garbage bin. We got a hot plate from next door neighbor. Thank you, Marie. Toaster. Got a microwave. A few pots and pans, power, That's where the water goes, We've got the boxes of dishes, stuff that we're going to use in the next two weeks and, or daily. No food, we're going to just cook it down here and eat upstairs. We got the coffee machine for, for the construction and uh, for you on every morning. Task note for me. I'm going to wash our dishes here, try them, and yeah, these are closet from upstairs, a few odds and ends. And we're good to go as a construction of our kitchen renovation 2013. This is going to be a view from one TV. It's going to be all open. Wouldn't that be nice? Whoa, we got to go this way. Then we'll go outside. In case you want a barbecue, got a table up there, the barbecue. We're going to keep this mirror, I don't know, full length mirror. It's nice to have until we get one uh, for our bedroom. Okay, that's it. Thank you for watching this episode of. Uh, I've, Watch for the pictures in our Kitchen Renovation 2013 album on Facebook. Thank you. Day two of our kitchen renovation. This is where we eat. It's our living room, short as it is. We have TV. We've got uh, Holly. Attached to the vaulted ceiling, down to the floor. It's going to be sealed here once we start putting up the ceiling and drywall. A few more changes going to be done. We've got to take out that wasp nest. Working, still working on the electrical. Uh, still working on this front area. Front closet, still working on electricity. This is where the stove will be. Plugs, potted lightings. We have extra lightings up here. We don't know about this. We might have a series of lights in the hallway, but there is real no hallway anymore. As much as we like this room, we're going to, uh, you know, we had to move this fan from over there 
uh, you know, so you can have a cleaner, cleaner roof with no bulkhead. So you have to do a drop ceiling, and rather than put crown molding, we're just going to put it about up to here, cover it all up, and fix that hole finally. Uh, do some drywalling, repaint it to normal, simple color. We moved our thermometer over here. That's where our uh, doorbell will go. Let's take out all the floor you see. That's gone to a good home. There'll probably be some more wiring in here. We're going to have a new light here instead of we used to have a plug that used to go over here and then a you know, chandelier, hanging chandelier. But we're going to have a a fixture here and possibly one or two fixtures here somewhere in that area here we're going to put a uh, that's going to be a carbon and a smoke detector a built-in one we're going to have three one in the basement one upstairs and uh, one on this floor we have a couple three-way switches that will go with the hallway and the lighting over here to come there's stuff to do here, I'm sure, with the plumbing. Uh, that might come later this week. I think we're going to try and get rid of this floor today. In some areas, it just peels off. In other areas, not so the case. It took a while just to get this full, you know, three by two square closet done. Well, the cat's locked in the basement, the dog's locked upstairs. The time is 7.30 and they will be here in about half an hour. So I'm going to go get ready. Thank you. Well, it's the dark start of day four. A lot has been uh, progressed what they have done. They had to move an air vent upstairs so they put a little extension here where our light is also going. Stairs have been cleaned. We've got this entrance which will be not a closet, maybe some hooks got our roof. We moved our light from over here to over here. We got a pony wall now. This is where our, our stove will be. Uh, counter, sink, dishwasher, microwave, fridge. Wall to wall counters and pantry space, I mean cabinets. Uh, we decided to put a light here. And we got a, an official light here before we used to have a plug in the corner that just had a hanging chandelier. And we had to move light switches. So we moved some here that work uh, for the island and for the kitchen in the back and we got hard wiring uh, smoke detectors and carbon monoxide testers that will be on all three floors this time we had our, a plumber come in and made an elbow moved it in just a bit so we're going to have a bulkhead just over our cabinets Cabinets will probably come up to that line there. That's where the bulkhead will go above it. Our bathroom, we had to move the fan for the over here to over here and drop it two and a half inches. We had an option to uh, you know, just do the top, save the paints, and put crown molding, but we decided we're just going to paint everything. We got new light fixtures. This was hard for us too, but we decided to uh, when we when we started, we'd keep all of this. 
but now we're going to have so much paint everything's going to be painted mostly one color except for the back wall will have a different color but this will be one color, this will be one color all those will be gone this will be one color this will really stick out so we're just going to paint over it and just you know, it's nice while it lasted you know it's really a shame It matches our fireplace and the uh, tiling we have on the fireplace. It is what it is. Oh, this is what it looks like where we'll be eating. Not bad. We have a new light here. We've got a new light for outside. We're just going to put that one in the back. Uh, we have to move the switch from over here where there's no door up to here. Uh, we're going to tighten this up. That's what the smoke detector looks like. And carbon monoxide. Oh, it. That air vent ended up here. We moved our cable. It used to be way in the corner. Over here, and we were at it all the way around the bedroom. It was crazy. So I fixed that. It's good. My office, I don't want to even show you. That's the storage stuff. It's for day four. Today they're going to do more painting, uh, not painting, taping, stucco, uh, drywall taping, sanding, moving everything around, and then work on the floor, cleaning it, put the board on. finish up this wall with a drywall and do this thing and oh it should be interesting okay oh thank you